Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'm coming at you with some uh, basketball. 2020-2021 Panini Donners Optic Hoops. Six box, pick your team number 13. It's a half case from a fresh case right here. First off, very big thanks to everyone here who picked their teams. Ooh, Max Muncy, going yard? Oh, off the wall. Oh, Dodgers, Rockies on the background. Anyway, big thanks everybody here for picking your teams in uh, pick your team 13. If you have a little rooftop next to your name, that means you won that team in the team random. That's what you were randomized. A little team randomizer. So thanks for every uh, to everyone participating in that as well. And Ben ended up with Last Spot Mojo. Before we pulled the teams out for that team random randomizer, Ben got Last Spot Mojo with the Wizards. There's the fresh case right there. 2020, 2021, Donner's Optic Basketball. Half case break. Select a die. I like that one. And we're going to go one, two, three for the left side and four, five, six for the right side. And it's four. One, two, three, four, five, six. This side we will save for picker team 14, which is on the site right now, and it's halfway full. So we'll mark those boxes. My little chicken scratch there, 1, 4, 14, so we know it's from the same case. All right, and now let's pop this guy open here. Good luck. What up, Oliver? Oliver wants to see some nice rockets. Do you want to you want to speak any uh, players into existence here? Any specific rockets you're looking for? Basketball training camp starting pretty soon. You know who's not going to be in basketball training camp? Ben Simmons. Where does he go? I guess that was the big news I saw over in the last day or two, right? That Ben Simmons is just is digging in his heels. He is not going anywhere. Or he is he digging in his heels saying he wants to go elsewhere. So he's saying, no, I'm not going to report to camp. I want to trade. Where does he end up? Yeah, Ben's got the Kings in this one. He's looking for a gold vinyl Halliburton. That'd be pretty nice. Oliver's looking for some Kenyon Martin Jr., some Jayshon Tates. Both of, those, both of those guys showed some flashes of, of what they could be. Enough for the sacrifice? Yes. Hmm, Mark got a Halliburton auto the other night, but I haven't seen any similar ones on eBay yet. I think I, I would suggest that, like pretty much anybody, any significant name that we pull at this stage of the calendar year, I would just hold on to it and see how the season starts and plays out for some of these players especially the top tier rookies. Because if they start off the season hot, you know, like if Patrick Williams starts the season off hot, his value can get a pretty early spike right there. 56 out of 199, Lonnie Walker the fourth. Yeah, Steve doesn't think the teams will be playing, paying top dollar for Ben Simmons. Yeah, they're not gonna move big assets for Ben Simmons at this point. So now, so what do you do? I mean, you're the Sixers, you're kinda, I guess you can just find him. We got Precious Achua for the Heat. Sean Maddock got randomized the Heat in that team random. 
first auto. That puts the organization in a tough spot. Because now you're like, well, now I'm either have to have him sit and just be, you know, be a constant distraction to our team. Oh, nice Obi top in orange, 94 out of 199. Nice color match there, too. That's for Sheng and the New York Knicks. Toppin has a big year. He starts off the season strong. Could be big time right there. Anthony Edwards, the rookies insert silver. That'll be for Scott and the Timberwolves. Nice. Another Precious Chua, Rated Rookie Hollow. Trey Young, Lime Green to 149. That's for the ATL. That'll be for Douglas. All card ship as well, Donner's Optic Basketball. There's Tyrese Halliburton, Rated Rookie for Ben. Let's find some parallels for Ben. There's a Kenyon. This is this is that's who uh, Oliver's looking for. There's Bogdan Bogdanovich. And there's Westbrook, U Laker. Wise guy, what's up? Are the Astros <laughs> really? You're asking. You're asking like like we made a mistake. No, that's it's not not a mistake. Thank you, Mojo. I know it seems like we don't we don't know what we're doing, but believe it or not, we've been we've been uh, pricing teams for seven eight years now. We kind of know what we're doing. Well, make sure you look at that, that other either either I mean they're make they're the ones probably making the mistake but make sure that's not like for a one box break or something like that there's Bogdanovich again to 199 remember we're doing full cases Alex Caruso to 149. No, I'm teasing, wise guy. No, you can definitely. Yeah, it's not that serious. I'm, I'm obviously teasing. No, yeah, I mean, everyone, everyone can 
and ask as many questions as I want to. Tyler Bay to 59. Was it for a full case break? Base OB Toppin. Brandon Ingram. Nice hollow Luka Doncic. Let's save one of those. And there's Trez, 99. And Daniel Toru. Clippers auto. That's going to go to Mike Tower in the clip show. I mean, wise guy, my guess is that uh, is that the, their box configuration might be a lot smaller. You know, it could be like a two-box break or something like that. Three-box break. And I mean, at the end of the day, every breaker can price. This is the this is a uh, the rare photon parallel, by the way. Not a rookie, but it's Michael Bridges for the Suns, Travis. I mean, ultimately, every breaker can price the teams the way they want to. I guess if if one breaker has a price that's like super low, I'll bet you some of the other teams are gonna be are gonna be a lot higher than us. But. I think Jaspies, we're we're pretty, we're pretty, uh, we're pretty on a uh, on market rate. It was a whole case. Hmm. And I'll I'll bet, I'll bet other teams are a lot more expensive where that cost has been moved around a little bit, or they're just way off on the pricing. But hey, it's like. Like finding the best odds at different sports books in Vegas. Some sometimes some breakers will or some books will have a mistake on the line. And you gotta jump on that. Take advantage. I mean there are a lot of inexperienced sort of group breakers that are out there, so there's probably a lot of different places where you can take advantage of mistake pricing. A couple more packs here. Next box. Good luck. We got Kawhi Leonard to 49 for the Clippers. We got a lime green CJ Ellaby. 004 out of 149. Got a Tyler Bay Black Velocity, two out of 39. Dallas Mavericks. That'll be for Emery. And the Mavs. And we got Robert Woodard, signature series, insert signature for Ben and the Kings. And there's our first Lamello base card for Charlotte. That's going to be for Sean Maddock. Picked up the Hornets straight up. Well, let's let's not advertise them on our page there.
Cole Anthony hollow. <laughs> People to buy that on our site. Cole Anthony hollow going to Mark and the Magic. Here's Duncan Robinson to 199, orange. John Morant stargazing hollow. Second year John Morant. Come on, Dodgers. That's for the Grizz. That's for Travis. And the Duncan Robbins for Miami. Sean. Maybe gets more minutes. Kendrick Nunn is with the Lakers now, so maybe that means more, more minutes for Duncan Robinson. And another Obi Toppin, this time red parallel, 16 out of 99. Knicks, Sheng with the Knicks. And a James Weissman, the rookies, insert for the Warriors, Sean Breen. Is he, is he, did he just get like a little knee surgery or something like that? I'd like to, I'd like the Warriors to. I know there's been a lot of speculation that Weissman would be a trade chip or something like that. So the Warriors are maybe a little in win now mode, but I'd like to see him stay with the Warriors. I could be see see how he develops with with that team. Could be good for the hobby. What are the Giants doing right now? Let's look at the Giants score. They're up 1-0 on the Padres. Come on, Padres. So we are halfway through this half case break. Good luck, everybody. Let's see what we got here. Another OB Toppin rated rookie. And is that an autograph coming up for the Bulls? No, Lime Green Patrick Williams got trolled there. Lime Green Patrick Williams to 149. That'll be for the Bulls. EA. I thought it was an autograph, Eric. Thought that was going to be an auto. And we got a rated rookie hollow, Isaiah Stewart. And of the rookies, Anthony Edwards. Scott with the Timberwolves had that hollow parallel a little bit earlier. Isaiah Stewart Hollow. It's got some upside. And another Lamello ball. No parallel yet, but a couple base cards for Sean M and the Hornets. Got the Hornets straight up. So maybe let's find a hollow for him. Maybe an autograph. TJ Warren to 99. And a James Weissman autograph. Rated rookie auto for the Warriors. Sean Breen this time. Different Sean. Sean Breen joined the filler, got randomized the Warriors, 
ends up with the James Weissman rated rookie on card autograph. I know wise guy. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not acting like you're BSing. I think you're taking this way too seriously. No, I mean that's a, there's a difference. I mean I don't know what to say. Every, everyone prices things differently. I mean I'm pretty confident that our price is correct though. I don't think anyone said you were BSing. <laughs> Prices are different. What, what, am, what am I supposed to do? That's it. They've got it priced one way. We've got it priced another way. I don't know how much the Hornets were. Probably a lot. <laughs> that th thousand, maybe? Let's look. Mm. Hornets were twelve hundred for a half case break. Sean Maddock actually got him in the second half too. Padres tied it up. There you go, Padres. All right. Second to last box. The second half of this case we can do tonight as well. There's Xavier Tillman to 99. And then we, what do we have here? Knicks, Signature Series, David Lee. I don't know what to say, wise guy. I'm sorry. I, I apologize for being a little curt on that earlier, but I don't think anyone was saying you were BSing. I, th I don't know how else to answer that question. They've got it at one price. We have it at a different price. We think our price is right. They think their price is probably correct. Uh, I mean, I don't know. That's, that's that. I, I believe you. I'm not questioning that. Everyone has different prices. That's, I mean, that's, that's really all it is. It's simple as that. Got a DeMontis Sabonis green. Pacers. Michael D. Got randomized the Pacers in that team random that we did. And a train whistle. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo. Skylar Mays, orange to 199. 
And we've got a Nikola Jokic, 51 out of 99. Elite Dominators insert going to Denver. That'll be for Derek. J.J. Redick, I think, just announced his retirement. All right, final box. I don't think you're. I don't think he's trolling, guys. No, you, we're not saying that. I'm not saying that. The question was fine. We answered it, and that's that. I mean, I don't know if there's really anything else to say. Thanks, Nick. Thanks, Ben. To one ninety nine, James Harden. This hollow Pokusevsky is going to go to Tyler and the O and OKC. And another photon, short print, Christoph Porzingis, Emery with Dallas. And a Nico Mannion, pink velocity, 61 out of 79. Warrior, Sean Breen. And we've got an Isaiah Stewart autograph, rated rookie. Hollow on card auto. That's Eric K. Got the piston straight up. I feel like the pistons. He's got them. He's got some youngsters. That could all evolve together at the same time. Maybe some surprise some teams in a season or two. Kind of like the. Uh, I don't know. So, I mean, sort of like the Knicks. I mean, they they've accumulated. They've been accumulating, you know, draft picks for for ages, and it's finally starting to click. It seems like R.J. Hampton, one forty one out of one forty nine. They're all kind of the same age, similar ages. They can all evolve together. Could be pretty interesting. Brandon Clark to 99. And the very last card, LaMelo Ball, the rookies. Insert. And we didn't see any autographs of LaMelo. We didn't see, uh, like, refracted. We didn't see any nice parallels or anything like that. But that could be in the second half. Here you go, Sean Maddock. He also has the Hornets in the second half. Maybe we'll, we'll see a big LaMelo there. Hey, thanks for watching, everybody. Thanks for breaking with us. Appreciate it.
Here's a quick little recap on some of the parallels and the autos. Yeah, nothing too crazy for the Kings there, Ben. Sorry. That, that uh, Hollow Anthony Edwards was pretty sharp too. But hey, maybe that second half, which we can do tonight. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.